This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. What's going on, everybody? This is Jacob Shoup. You're watching the 4 p.m. stock market update right here on TFNN. If you missed the show uh, that we just had the past hour, I was joined by Basil Chapman and Tim Ord. If you want to go over uh, those interviews I had, our producer is hard at work. He's going to clip both of those interviews and upload it to our YouTube channel at Tiger Financial News Network. If you decide to go ahead and watch those, please consider liking the video and consider subscribing to our channel because it helps us out immensely. I hope you all had a good day. I know it's a little bit... Ah, uh, you know, I never like trading close to holidays like this because it's just, uh, can never tell how it's going to go. But the market today, uh, let's the, and the indices have done okay today, right? You're seeing um, a lot of the stocks that were running up pretty heavily uh, the past week are kind of taking a breather today, coming off a little bit. Let's look at the composite right now, about 0.63% trading at $19,174. You have the Dow Jones Industrial up 0.28% at 44860 and you get the SPY, uh, Oh, trading up 0.59%. Uh, it's 601. Man, we cracked it. Now, nice. There we go. It's another high. You know, I mean, I've been seeing all this, these headlines about like a melt up. And I mean, it feels, it feels almost like that. Like at least in some of these smaller stocks. I mean, when you're talking like, you're getting gains on earnings of, you know, these smaller cap stocks of like 30, 40%, 50% pushing it. And, you know, there was just an exuberance, I think, after, um, the, the presidential election results and it, people still want to be in and it's still being spoken about. And I'm telling you what Basil was speaking about uh, when I had him on, again, strongly recommend checking out that clip we're going to have up on, on the YouTube channel is, you know, he was talking about when he was, I think Bitcoin had rallied, you know, maybe a few years ago when he was at a New Year's Eve party and everybody was talking about it. He was like, oh no, we might've just made a peak D. And it's like, yeah, I mean, you get everyone now is trading, putting a little bit money Robin Hood's getting a bunch of people signing up for it, trying to invest some more. And, um, you know, sometimes that can really precede a, uh, a meltdown in the market. So it's interesting to see kind of what's going on with that. Um, anything else interesting? I mean, Disney at 115, Intel, let's boo this together, everyone, off 3.42%. Didn't get as much money as people anticipated, off about, about 600 million. And then Rivian got the go ahead there on one of their plans. Uh, wow, that actually turned down for the day. Unbelievable. <sighs> you can never win all the time. Folks, thank you so much for joining me. We'll see you tomorrow morning with Tommy O'Brien, 9 a.m. for the morning market kickoff. Hope you have a great rest of your evening.